Tell me how heated is that? I know friendly, but how heated is that wide receiver battle just across the board with so many talented players? Um, you know, it's fun. It's fun to get out here and you know just compete with the guys that that uh, we have on our team. I mean, there's a lot of competition going on, but you know we're just making each other better. Where have you improved? I mean, you're, you're obviously fighting for a spot with two or three other guys. Mm -hmm. Where have you improved from last year that would give you the, the idea that you got a pretty good shot to, to crack? Uh, honestly, I think the the biggest thing that I improved was my confidence and just getting used to the game speed that we that we uh, play over here. I mean, my high school we play we play uh, a similar offense, but the speed here is just a lot a lot quicker, a lot faster, and the gameplay the players are a lot faster. So I just had to get used to it. And how do you get from Hawaii? To um, you know, it was, it, it was kind of weird because A&M came late in my recruiting. My recruiting, uh, I, I think maybe on July 24th, that's when I committed on my birthday and I took my visit out here. And I was just blown away with the atmosphere, the fans out here, and you know, just the coaching staff, they're, they're nice and my family liked it. So I, I knew this was the place for me once I came on my visit. How important is Malcolm Kennedy to y'all's room? Oh man, he, he he is very important. You know, he he always tells us that that we can be the best the best wide receiver uh, core in the country if we just do what we do and play hard, practice hard, and just believe in ourselves and our coaches. What was your first year here like? I just I mean, obviously a lot of new experiences, probably a little bit different atmosphere. What was it like adjusting here over the last year? Uh, it took me a while to adjust, but I mean, with with, with the coaches down here and the fans, you know, with, with the support that I have down here and. From back home, you know, they kept me straight online. So it, was, it, it took me a while, but I, I'm used to it, and I love, I love it down here now. For yourself and for even some of the other young guys like Quib that got on the field some last year, how big was that for you guys as you come into this season? Oh, it was big because, uh, I mean, we, now we know the gameplay and the game speed and what the coaches expect from us on the field. So, I mean, it, it, it helped us a lot coming into this season. Is there a new guy or wide receiver that's really stood out to you? Um. You know, all the incoming freshmen out here, they all they all uh, came out to play. They all stood out to me. So, have you, you seen any improvement? You guys don't have to hit the practice field tomorrow. What do you do to continue to work and get better? I mean, you know, we just gotta work work mentally, uh, watch film. You know, we we just gotta get together as a group and see what what else we have to work on and stuff to be the best wide receiver point in the country. Well, Ricky Ricky only got to play that one game. We got hurt last year. What improvement have you seen from him from last year to this year since he's been back? Oh man, Ricky works hard. He worked once he got hurt, he was devastated. But I know he worked hard. Me and him, off season, we used to get in extra extra work and stuff. But Ricky worked hard to be where he's at now, and I, I know he'll, he'll do good things for us. How much is he really leading? Because you guys did lose a whole bunch of not, not only production but great leaders off that receiving core. Him being just a redshirt freshman, a second year player, but how much is he leading? Like, other than Malcolm, is he one of the other guys? Yeah, I mean, all, all of us pick up after each other and just you know. Just tell each other we got we got your back. If you mess up, we got your back. Cause I mean, we all we all mess up, so we we're always there for each other. Jeremy, this might be an easy uh, answer for you. I don't know, but out of all you guys in the receiving court, who would you say is the fastest? Yeah, that's tough. I, I mean, I only race Quiv. Me and Quiv go back and forth, so I think we're right now we're tied at two and two in the forty yard dash. Okay. <laughs> could you take Speedy? Uh, I don't know. Speedy fast. We got we got a race. He fast. He not his name Speedy for a reason. What's your forty? Uh, I ran a four three four hand time and I ran a four four two electronic. What have you seen from the progress of Kyle and Kenny in the off season and, and how they've been throwing the ball? Oh man, both of them they they are very uh competitive. You know, they they they're similar to each other, and I think whoever wins the starting job they're gonna take us far.